Fresno State and San Jose State today at Bob Bennett Stadium. The Bulldogs won the first game of the series on Friday. The Spartans won yesterday. San Jose State also won today. Several lead changes in this one, including in the ninth when the Spartans scored three runs. 7-5 the final score. Fresno State falls to 2-4 and four in conference. McCarthy Tatum was once again in the cleanup spot for the Bulldogs today. That's been the case a lot this season. Julia Lopez joins us now to tell us more about Tatum, which is his last name, not his first name. We will get to that. Well, he, yeah, yeah, he's been hot at the plate for the Diamond Dogs, extending his hitting streak to 11 games today, and he's valley grown through and through. He's got two last names, so it's kind of, it's kind of a crazy. I remember the other day we walked to some like restaurant, and they called him Tatum first name, and he was just kind of bummed. You could see, so the whole rest of the day we we're just calling him Tatum. I've been called Tatum McCarthy my whole life. I've probably been called that more than my real name, honestly. So. Uh, people get it mixed up all the time, but it's all good. Nah, that's all right. It, it was my grandma's maiden name, so I love my name and it would always be there with me. McCarthy Tatum is the name, and he's been in the Central Valley sports scene for a while. In 2014, he was a senior on the Clovis Cougars baseball team. It's an honor to play for Clovis High. That was ranked number one in the state. Winning was everything to us, and we refused to lose. 33-5 and five in high school is pretty good, so uh, we, we just always had a smile on our face and had fun every day. Tatum scored the game-winning run in the Valley Championship to beat rival Buchanan 3-2. He was a successful two-way player as a third baseman and pitcher. Ever since we played Little League together, it's just knowing how good he is and seeing him play in high school, he was like the Valley Player of the Year my junior year. Now that's big coming from a Buchanan Bear. During Tatum's senior campaign, he went 11-1 on the mound with a 1.79 ERA and also hit close to 300 at the dish. I haven't seen a high school player since, probably since I saw Chase Utley 100 years ago, square up as many balls as a junior and senior in summer ball and in his high school games. Seemed like every ball he hit was right on the barrel. And that's finally, he's, he's finding that 6'6 six, six frame and it's starting to come back to him. When he got to Fresno State, he was listed at 6'2 and he hit a growth spurt. Now he's a redshirt senior listed at 6'6, six, six, but he did have some growing pains along the way, including missing all of 2017 with an elbow injury. It's been a rough couple years for me. I've had three surgeries and haven't been in the lineup all that much and it's just feels good to be healthy and be able to play with my teammates. Last year he injured his hand mid-season, but he did play in 24 games, made 18 starts, 15 in left field, two at first base, one as a DH, hitting 232. He sat out the entire 2017 season due to that injury. In 2016, he played in 38 games with 24 starts, 23 at third, one at first while hitting 218. And in 2015, as a freshman, he appeared in 20 games and made eight starts, all at shortstop, and he hit 192. It was tough to watch him, but it was nice to see how he's always just been that good teammate. He's always supported you. He's one of the nicest guys I've ever met. But now that he's finally getting his chance, and you, like I knew all along he's going to do good, so it's just nice to see him come out here and just compete. It's been really fun to watch, not just so much physically, but mentally he's on a mission. And uh, I think in the end, it's all going to, he's going to get what he wanted when he came here. Tatum was drafted in the 20th round by the Twins right out of high school, but decided to go to college instead. He's already earned his bachelor's degree, but is looking for more. He's already working on his master's degree, and he's still going to get drafted pretty good and have a chance uh, to play some pro ball. This means everything to me. Uh, it could end today, it could end tomorrow, you never know. So I'm just taking it every pitch at a time, every minute at a time, and enjoying every second of it. So Tatum told us that his best memory so far as a Bulldog is winning a share of the Mountain West regular season championship back in 2016. But it is so hard not to root for McCarthy Tatum. And his average right now is 371, which is light years beyond where it was when he first started at Fresno State. <laughs> Thanks very much, Julia.